a king placed his son in the care of an elderly, trusted advisor. The advisor noticed that the boy was prone to uncontrollable fits of rage. One day, the advisor observed the prince fighting and berating a group of children with whom he was playing. No one dared speak out or bring attention to his behavior for fear of the wrath of the king. The advisor walked over to the boy, yanked him by his wrist, dragging him away from the crowd, kicking and screaming. He lifted the squealing child, carrying him to the palace garden. Many bees were buzzing around the plants and flowers. The advisor walked over to a plant that had an enormous horde of bees flying around it. He shoved the boy's hand into the swarm. One of the bees stung him. He screamed out in pain as the advisor yanked his hand away from the horde. My father will punish you for what you have done, wailed the child. Maybe, responded the old man, but before that happens, I want you to look at the bee that stung you. He pointed toward the ground. The boy was so focused on the pain in his hand and the protruding stinger left behind that he failed to notice the fallen bee. He looked at the ground where the bee lay writhing. The extraction of its stinger exposed the insides of its body. He stood there, transfixed, watching as the bee died a slow, agonizing death. Remain as you are, admonished the advisor, and your fate will be that of the bee. Anger destroys the angry. That day, the young prince learned a valuable lesson. When he became king, it was a lesson that he never forgot. He ruled knowing the price of anger. Doni doni, kununi benyagada.